Makofi tafadhali. The resumption of Kenya Airways flights between Nairobi and London was seen as a reset button in the diplomatic and economic ties between Kenya and the UK. Kenya's High Commissioner to UK, Manoa Esipisu, who received the inaugural commercial flight in London, said businesses between Kenya and UK are connected by people-to-people -people movement. Proper deals are negotiated when business people are meeting their counterparts. And if you look at the relationship between Kenya and the United Kingdom, there are more than 250 British companies in Kenya. The UK is the highest private sector employer uh, in Kenya because their companies employ hundreds of thousands of people. And therefore, it's, it's, it's quite important that you, you have that relationship going. Secondly, if uh, Kenya perceives itself as the business hub for the region, which it is, uh, then it has to be able to open up uh, to external uh, business visitors, uh, both for itself and also for the region. So it is very important in that respect that the business people from the United Kingdom, business people from Europe, are able to link up with their counterparts as well. And thirdly, just in terms of tourism, uh, the UK is, a, is, is one of the major source destinations for tourists to Kenya. The Europe is a major source destination of tourists to Kenya. We have a big Kenyan student population in the UK. The summer is here, so there is a lot of movement between Nairobi and, and London for students. Deputy High Commissioner to Kenya, who attended the launch of the London flights, said Kenya Airways has been symbolic in sustaining the bilateral relations between the two countries. Since the pandemic became such a global concern, we know that many people have just wanted to go home. We have many British people who work in Kenya, who live here, who call Kenya home most of the time, but have their families in the UK. So after airspace closed, we worked very carefully with KQ to in, order, in order to have some flights to get those people back to the UK and it meant a huge amount to them. We're sure that they will come back to Kenya, uh, but, but they wanted to be home for a while during the pandemic and KQ enabled us to do that. And there was also cargo. Uh, what impact has it man, uh, made and of what importance has it been to the two countries? Mm. Yes, so uh, one in every two cups of tea drunk in the UK is Kenyan tea. Your flowers are in our supermarkets, your vegetables feed us. So it's so important that we were able to create air bridges to get those uh, horticulture products uh, over from Kenya to the UK to be in our supermarkets to feed our people. And KQ enabled that freight uh, transport to happen. The Chief Administrative Secretary for Foreign Affairs, Ababu Namwamba, said the resumption of international flights in general was a loud message that Kenya was ready to engage with the world. London is not just any other, any other station. London is a, a destination that has a, a very strong historical and uh, emotional ties to, to Nairobi. And uh, going to London is actually telling Europe, Kenya is back to, to Europe and Kenya is ready to engage with the world. And, and, and there's no better place really to announce that arrival than London, with whom we share such historical umbilical cord. For a start, there will be two Kenya Airways flights per week on the London route. That is every Saturday and Tuesday. But according to the national carrier, the flights are subject to regulatory approvals updated on a weekly basis and frequency will increase as demand peaks. I live in Kenya, so I've been very happy to be stuck here and not travel too much. But now I'm going back to visit my family in the UK. What do you do in Kenya? Uh, I work on a uh, building project in Kilifi. Lockdown is to fungia. So say to Narubi UK and to Rashkuru Mungu. UK where you find your Nini Oko? Mini Nafanya Kaja Peshara Manabashara. This is where we are, so we just, just need to cope with the disease. What do you do in London? I'm a doctor and I've got two children, I've got a husband and had come to bury my dad and I got stuck here. Departure from Nairobi to London is 9.20 a.m. East Africa time and the flight from London will be departing at 12.35 a.m. London time. For Champs Media, I'm Alex Chamada.